where I got peace was in these breathing exercises, mm. swimming outside in the cold. G'day guys, how's it going? It's Cody Orgel. Uh, today, we're going to be doing the Wim Hof Method. Um, so, I've already done it. It's been 30 days I've been doing the Wim Hof Method for. Um, and I'm proposing, a bit, I guess, a bit of a challenge to you guys to try and do the same. Now, I brought the course, the Fundamentals course, which uh, is currently actually 50% off right now. Um, there's a link down below if you want to purchase that. Now, by no means you don't have to. Um, but I, I personally brought it because of this um, COVID sort of situation and everything. Um, I feel like I was getting a bit stressed and I wanted to try something just to sort of get me out of that mental state and and try and just be calm, centered in the present moment, enjoying life, you know, as much as I can during these challenging times. Um, and, and I know a lot of people kind of sort of stress and stuff like that. And I thought um, this would be pretty cool to propose the idea to you guys if you haven't heard of Wim Hof or, or you have heard of Wim Hof and you want to get more into it or whatever. Um, and again, you don't have to purchase his course. I'm just saying it is linked down below and I am an affiliate. So if you purchase the course, I get a bit of a commission, but it's also 50% off now. I'm not sure how longer it's going to be 50% off for, so it's a really good opportunity. But you can um, just go to YouTube, type in Wim Hof Breathing Method, um, and it'll, it'll come up with where you can listen um, and be guided by him to do the breathing method. So if you've never tried it before, you can use that as a guide. So um, that's a starting point. If you've never heard of Wim and you wanna see what he's about, um, check that out. Uh, it's a good guide, introductory guide to get into it. But I found like from day one when I first, when I took the course, um, so for example, I'm gonna get the course up right now. So with the course, uh, there's a series of lessons that each, um, you know, introduced you one le new lesson every every week. Now I'm going to be doing an in-depth review of the fundamentals course once I've gone through everything, but I'm only a month in and it's a 10 week course. So I'm only four or so weeks into it, right? But each week you get a new lesson um, and he'll introduce the lesson, you go through that, and then you get homework as well along with it. So it's structured in a way that you do the breathing method or you do the stretches first, it's like yoga stretches and stuff, unique stretches, and then you do your breathing method and then you have homework that you've got to do for the week. Um, and that's sort of the structure of it, and that's what I've been doing for the last um, 30 days or so. So essentially, if, you, if you're not sure what it is, let me just quickly um, do a quick run through. So it's a breathing method. So you breathe in your stomach, chest to your head. So it's like, and you're fully breathing in when you do that, and then it's half out. So it's just like, so, and you're doing that about 30 times or so. And when you do it for so many times, you're charging your body, you're putting in so much oxygen that you normally don't do. You normally don't give that much oxygen to your body. Um, and it kind of creates all these really amazing benefits. So I have the benefits that he says um, on, on his website here. So it increases your willpower. But essentially, before I get into the benefits, essentially what the goal and the idea of this whole thing is, is, is creating a mind and body connection. So you're connecting the two and it's essentially helping you live in the present moment. Um, I guess connect to yourself on a deeper level. So if you're into spirituality and stuff like that, um, it can develop your spiritual awakening and spiritual journey if you are on one um, and you're interested in that sort of stuff. That's kind of what it's doing. Um, and it also helps with meditation, I found as well. So when I did the, the method straight after, I would meditate and I would feel like I could just get in that state of mind where thought sort of disappears and you're kind of like in this um, realm of nothingness, if that makes sense. So anyway, guys, um, he, he says you get an increased uh, willpower, boost concentration, um, you get to deal with depression a lot easier, um, burnout recovery, uh, natural anti-inflammatories, um, you get like arthritis relief. There's a lot of things that um, has been claimed this has this been able to, to help with, and it's been backed up with science as well. So. It's an incredible um, system and method that Wim has created, and he is just an absolute machine, like of the cold. He's he's incredible, um, an inspiration, and I love what he's doing. But um, the course itself and the method, it's helped me, you know, be a lot more peaceful in my day-to-day -day life. Like I would find sometimes, you know, like I would get caught up in thought and identify myself with thought when. Really, I am sort of, you know, the the present being behind the thought, if that makes sense. And I kind of started to understand that. And also, I'd find, like, when I get in a negative thought, I'd, you know, just get caught up in that and then 
feel very sad, somber, and I guess, I wouldn't call it depression, but it's just like not, you know, just, just feeling bad, whatever. And I felt when I would do the method, it would completely erase that from my mind and sort of be like a reset button for me to clearly see the world with fresh eyes, if that makes sense. Um, that was one of the incredible things that I love about it, and I'm going to keep continuing to do it just because of that. Um, I also felt, because it is, um, I forgot to mention the cold showers as well. So it's a cold therapy as well. Yeah, when you first start, like the first week of cold water therapy, it's really brutal. Um, that's why he starts off with about 30 seconds of exposure for a cold water first. So if you guys don't know anything about this, first, yes, you get to have a nice warm shower. And then at the end of your warm shower, um, every day you turn it to cold. I gradually turn it to cold and then eventually get to freezing cold water where you try and um, endure it for at least 30 seconds to begin with. And then after that, you're increasing it to a minute, a minute and a half, and then two minutes. So guys, I just got out of the shower. This is uh, day number five for me. Um, so this is my fifth shower in a row, cold shower in a row. Um, and I'm at a point now where when I have a cold shower, this was actually started yesterday. So pretty much all the benefits that I'm starting to really significantly feel are starting from day number four. So um, yesterday I was able to have a cold shower without feeling, you know, like shivering or like resistance against it. It became more tolerable. Um, and then today, day number five, I just got out of the shower. I could literally stay in there. Um, all day if I wanted to under the freezing cold it was completely turned on to cold it's amazing and then after you get out of the shower you're not cold it's weird because when you have a really hot shower when it's cold outside or something like that or just normally any cool temperature um, when you get out of the hot shower you feel cold but when you get out of a cold shower you feel warm if I feel like it warms you up from the inside out when a warm shower just temporarily warms you on the outside and it doesn't get to the inside if that makes sense and then you just get cold again and just like the physical benefit i feel like my brain is just amped and ready to go to get the day started so it's just incredible now that i've done it for 30 days i'm able to have a nice warm shower and then at the end of that warm shower turn it to completely cold for about 10 seconds it's really really a struggle to cope with the cold water but once you're fully immersed with cold water all over your body for about after 10 seconds you can just stay under there for as long as you really want if you wanted to um I'm able to stay under there for so long under freezing cold water and not be like <gasps> shivering because you're doing that practice where you're getting so much oxygen in that you're not like frantically <laughs> gasping for air because you have that training. I don't know how it works, but it's just incredible. Like you're able to um, cope with cold water a lot more easily. Yeah, there's a few other things that I'll probably cut to because I filmed, you know, once every week for the last four or so weeks that I've done it um, and just given a bit of an update and stuff. So I might um, sort of jump to some of those clips right now and you guys can get a bit of an understanding of what it was like sort of straight after I did the, the method um, and see what you guys think about it. So guys, I just had the most amazing experience. This is day number four of the Wim Hof breathing method. Um, as you can probably tell, I'm in like the most blissful state right now. Um, I just took some notes down and oh wow, man. Like, it was insane. I feel like I just opened my third eye, no joke. Like, I actually had visions of, of eyes, like, in front of me, like, I was hallucinating. It was insanely amazing. And then, um, I watched The Tiger King on Netflix. It's, like, this Netflix special. And it must be a connection with that, because I saw a tiger right in front of my face. It was insane. Yeah, it was like a cartoon-looking tiger, and it just was right in front of me with closed eyes looking straight into my eyes. And I think, like, the main theme of, like, this, I don't know if... It, I guess hallucination or whatever is eyes like and I think it has a connection with my third eye like I've just opened it up um, it sounds woo woo and stuff guys but you really have to experience this for yourself to really understand what I'm talking about and obviously everybody's going to have a different experience but I feel so at peace and blissful and then when I finished as well like I literally after the fourth round I literally felt as though I was not in my body if that makes sense with my eyes closed and then when I opened my eyes I almost just like cross that bridge back to my body if that makes sense now obviously it's just it's just incredible and then also um I also couldn't stop laughing I think I just said that but 
Like when I finished, I just laughed uncontrollably and I was just like, <laughs> I wish I got on camera, but I just kept laughing. Um, as if to say, like, I reached a point of peacefulness that's just so wonderful that I've tried, that I've heard so much about as well, in terms of a lot of people who have gone on sort of spiritual journeys and that. And I guess um, my psyche is like, you kind of reached some kind of similar experience. Um, and now, guys, I think I'm hooked on this method. Um, I'm going to keep doing this forever now. This is incredible. Um, then also, everything was white. Like, when I closed my eyes, it was like a glassy, um, frosty white, um, which was pretty cool. Um, Wim Hof says that you'll see colors because um, your, your nervous system is um, really activated and you'll see, like, the colors and that through your eyes. And also, like, my left arm was really like um tingly like the whole arm was tingling and like pins and needle kind of thing and also my eyes were just twitching uncontrollably which is why his part like that were the first things that would happen um the first time i did this method um but now i think four days in i'm getting to a point where um my body is opening up and becoming awakened um and i'm loving it <laughs> Also, guys, with the Fundamentals course, you get to download um, a workbook and you get to document, like, your week. So, I'm in the first week of going deep at the moment. And it's great because you document your process, how many rounds you do, and then your stretches and your cold shower, and then you take some notes as well of what you experienced. Yeah, guys, I just feel like I had a sense that everything in the world was going to be okay and I was going to be fine. It's just a very amazing experience. Can't wait to see what week 10 has in offer. All right, so week number two assignment of the Wim Hof Method is to expose our extremities, so our hands and feet into icy cold water, and that's what I'm doing at the moment. It's actually getting better now. It was really, really difficult for the first moments. I put my hand in the water. It still is, but it's less so right now. I'm gonna do this for two more minutes. We're one minute in at the moment. And then after we do that, we're supposed to throw our hands around for a little bit just to get the, I guess, the blood circulation happening again, but my hand's red raw. It doesn't really help for me because I've got two dud fingers that don't bend here, so that was really hard. But we got through it. Now we're doing the, the feet. It's not as cold, but it still bloody hurts. So guys, uh, it's week number three. I'm a few days into week number three now of the Wim Hof Method. I just got done with the session. Um, and this week, it's about energy control, or energy management, it's called. So we're doing two um, sessions, or two or three sessions of you know, 30 breaths that are really quick. So I was <sighs> sucking it all in and half out really, really quickly. And then it finishes it off with a 30 um, breaths of just normal breathing. Like of the ones we did at the beginning of this course. Um, and it's incredible. It seems to charge me a lot more than what the other weeks have done. He did mention that you do see lights in that, and I hadn't seen really significant lights or anything when my eyes were closed for a while but today I actually experienced that I maybe it had to do with the light because I'm outside as you guys can see and um, I had my hoodie over my eyes like this and it was really really pitch dark when I was doing the session and then as I pulled it off with my eyes closed I saw like a blood red like a and, and some orange sort of trickling through the red as well it was quite amazing um, like eyes completely closed, like really clunch closed real tightly, you'd expect to see black. But it was just the brightest of reds. It was quite phenomenal. Um, and then I started doing, you know, like looking up towards my brain or squeezing my head like to the third eye. And um, I started seeing like these lightning bolt, like, like it's sort of like energy, electricity waves, if you know what I mean, if that makes sense. I saw like a few of those like pulsating like in this area of my closed eyes. Um, it was just like two or three like bolts of lightning going horizontally across and back and then they would disappear. It was really, really cool. Um, so I definitely say I've managed my energy for today. I'm feeling very zen out and peaceful and I'm gonna get back to my blog and get some work done for today. So I have the course here and energy management is this week. Um, and I'm currently watching the homework video to see what sort of homework we're doing this week. Oh my little
muscles and flow reflexes. They're gonna work with you. So uh, during all uh, the whole course, it's go so guys. It's about week four, so we're almost a month into the Wim Hof method, and a session I just did, I felt my whole body tingling. So like up my arms, up in my head, everything, my whole body was just buzzing. So week number four is about inflammation. So if you seem to have like a sore back or, or you get like just a sore body overall, this week is really good for that. Um, it gets the blood flow happening in like the areas of the body where everything's tense and tight and things. But yeah, this, um, because every week's unique and it's different, which is what I love about the fundamentals course, which is what I'm taking. But I must give you guys a warning um, about something that happened a few nights back. Um, I was deep into, I think it was my first session of the fourth week, um, inflammation one, and I was just out of it, like I was not on this planet. And uh, someone knocked on the door, so I had to get up and I was deep in like a relaxed state. And for some reason I automatically got up to answer the door, I probably should have just laid there and not answered the door. However, I got to about the corner of the couch and I literally fainted or I stopped remembering and apparently I walked into the door and I ended up really hurting my toe bad. I think I might have broken it. Um, I don't know if you guys can see, but I did get a black eye, which I guess you can see a little bit there. Um, and I did the bottom of my lip here as well. Uh -huh. You can't really see that part, that's, that's cleared up. Um, but I, yeah, and it was funny, I was wearing my glasses and I had paint like smudged from the door that I ran into right there on my glasses. So just a word of warning, do not stand up, do not operate heavy machinery or anything like that while you're doing this method, because it's really powerful. Um, I believe I fainted, because um, there was a moment there where I hit the ground and I fell back, and I was out of it. And then I kind of woke up and I sort of gathered where I was in my surroundings and everything, but I was so out of it. and. Yeah, I think I might have fainted. So just a word of warning, be very careful with this. And don't get up suddenly when you've been doing the method because I think like maybe a lot of blood might have rushed to my head and um, it just, I don't know, somehow I fainted. But yeah, anyway, I just wanted to share that um, with you guys and make sure you guys don't do that and learn from my experience. But anyway, other than that, the method so far has been absolutely phenomenal. And I think it's coming at a really good time during this COVID-19 crisis and everything that's happening. Um, just being able to get that mental clarity because I'm kind of a little bit stressed, you know, at times with um, working from home and, and not being allowed to go, you know, outdoors um, as often as I would like or go travel. I really like traveling and going on adventures and things. And it's really hard to do that right now when all the borders are locked down and closed. Um, so it's kind of a mess. And... Um, the thing that I love doing the most travel is what I'm not allowed to do right now. So it's kind of restricting me and it's putting me in a negative state. But this method and um, also through doing the method, I get in a state of mind where everything's clear and I've been doing meditation straight after that. And I'm trying to do an hour meditation, but I do, you know, 15 to 30 minutes of meditation just sitting there in a um, cross-legged position um, and just letting the mind wander. And I find straight after the Wim Hof breathing method, it's puts you in a, in a good state mentally where you, can, where you can do meditation afterwards. So just another tip there, I would recommend um, just doing meditation after the, the breathing method because you're in an optimal state. Um, but through doing this stuff, I found that it's been able to um, make me cope a lot more during these times when it's you know uncertain and I guess people are losing their jobs and um, everything's going a bit crazy. So... Um, it's just a, a really good way to center yourself and, and make sure things are going well. But we're near the end of um, the 30 days so far. So yeah, it's uh, some exciting stuff. So to be honest guys, I can't really recommend you giving this a crack enough. It's, it's kind of changed everything for me, especially since this COVID situation and stuff. Like, I feel like I'm at peace and I'm just sort of so blissful. It's, it's quite incredible. I feel like, you know, when you're getting in all this oxygen... You're getting in so much blood um, and your body's just like oiled. It's, it's oiled like a well-oiled car, a well-oiled machine, right? Um, a few side effects that I've found is you'll get like tingling sensations and stuff like that. It's not really that bad. It's kind of a cool experience. Um, just the other night, like as I said before, I was just fully tingling like all over my body and everything was just like so active. Um, but 
Also, like I found, I, I would get some pressure in my head as well. So just keep that in mind that you might experience like headaches and stuff like that. Um, just for the moment when you're doing really intense breathing. Um, but other than that, I haven't really felt any other negative experiences other than that um, isolated incident where I stood up when I shouldn't have to answer the door and I completely fainted. Um, don't do that. Um, but yeah, just like the nervous system and the immune system is really benefited from this as well, as he says on his website. There's there's studies that they've done for the, the method to prove by some, with science that this stuff actually works. So there's no like doubt about it and it's not this wooey sort of spirituality nonsense, um, if that makes sense. Like it's not like this hippie woo-ha thing that isn't backed up by science. It's actually backed up by science and it works. Like from my personal experience, it bloody works. I can't believe how amazing it is. So yeah, again guys, if you want to try it, um, especially the fundamentals course, it's 50% off. So it's like over $400 or something like that. I was able to get it for around like 200 and something. I can't remember exactly. Damn good value. It's especially a really great time to try something like this when we're all at home. Um, not really, you know, we have a lot of time. We're not really doing as much as we normally do in our normal work days. And I really feel like the world needs something like this just to chill out and kind of like get in a, a state of connectiveness where we're connected to everything around us and to the people around us. Um, and I feel like this is the vehicle to do so. So again, guys, um, I'm going to keep you updated um, for the entire 10 weeks of this. It's, it's been about four weeks so far, about a month. And I'm feeling incredible and I can't wait. And I can't wait to see what week 10 has to offer. And I will be doing a re full review of the course um, after the 10 weeks. But yeah, guys, I thought I'd just make a video about it. And hopefully you got some value out of this. And hopefully you um, just go to YouTube, type in Wim Hof Breathing Method um, and try it out. Um, he has a, a guided thing there where you guys can get introduced to it. And just see what the effect has on you. I just recommend giving it a crack and see what happens. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any questions or you want to talk more about the method. Um, I'd love to uh, answer the comments there to you guys and, and um, answer any concerns or anything like that you may have. Um, thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.